Dear friends, I am Dr. K. Kannan, Professor Mechanical Engineering, Anjalayamal Mahalingam Engineering College, Koilvanni. I am happy to meet you again in the video lecture on the subject Design of Transmission System. And this is lecture number 2.2. .2. So, in this lecture, we are going to solve problem in the design of V belt. So, in the earlier lecture, we discussed the design procedure of V belt using the PSG data book. So, before you take up this video, you better visit the video so that you will get the understand the procedure and uh, how to pick up the information from the PSG data book. Then, the step by step procedure you can understand. Then, you can easily solve the problem in the design of V belt. The learning outcome to the student at the end of the lecture, the student will be able to solve problem in the V belt using PSG data book. So, all the problem we solve in the video lecture, they are from Anna University question paper. So, by looking at the design procedure and solution of the problem, uh, the student will gain the confidence so that you can attend the university examination with uh, with more confidence in your ability example number 1 from november 2015 question paper a v belt drive is to transmit 15 kilowatt to a compressor the motor runs at 1150 rpm and the compressor runs at 400 rpm determine belt specification number of belt correct center distance and drive pulley dimension so, we write down the given data. So, the power is 15 kilowatt, speed of the motor 1150 rpm, speed of the compressor is 400 rpm. Then, the speed ratio, first step you have to calculate the speed ratio. So, speed ratio equal to speed of the smaller pulley divided by speed of the larger pulley, small n by capital N. So, 1150 divided by 400 equal to 2.875. Then select the cross section of the belt based on the power to be transmitted. You refer to page number 7.58. We select the section C for this particular power output. So based on the power 15 kilowatt, you can take either B or C. I take C for the design. So then the details of the section C minimum pulley pitch diameter D equal to 200 millimeter. Nominal top width W equal 22 millimeter. Nominal thickness of the belt T equal to 14 millimeter. And the weight per meter length of the belt 0.343 kilogram force. Then diameter of the larger pulley. So the smaller pulley diameter minimum requirement is 200 millimeter. So diameter of the larger pulley I into small d. Capital D equal to I into small d. 2.875 into 200 equal to 575 millimeter. Then you take the C by D ratio from the data book, page number 7.61. For I equal to 2.875, C by D equal to 1.025. So the standard distance C equal to 1.025 into capital D, which is 1.025 into 575 equal to 589.375 millimeter. Then we calculate the arc of contact. So for the equation, you can refer to the page number 7.54. So, theta equal to 180 minus capital D minus small d divided by C into 60 degree that is equal to 180 minus substituting 0 0.575 minus 0 0.2 divided by 0 0.589375 into 60 equal to 141.8 degrees. Then we calculate the belt speed S yes, equal to pi dn by 60. So, pi into 0.2 into 1150 divided by 60 equal to 12.03 meters per second. Now, the small diameter factor I equal to 2 uh, for I equal to 2.875, you refer page number 7.62, FB equal to 1.13. So, small diameter factor. Then we calculate the equivalent pitch diameter of the smaller pulley. So, DE equal to DP into FB equal to 200 into 1.13 equal to 226 millimeter. Then we calculate the power rating of the belt for the cross section. So, this equation is also available in the PhD data book. You refer to the e uh, data book. For C section, 1.47 s to the power minus 0 0.09 minus 142.7 divided by DE minus 2.34 10 power minus 4 S square multiplied by S. So, this is the equation. 
Now we substitute the numerical values 1.47 into 12.03 to the power minus 0 0.09 minus 142.7 divided by d e in millimeter 226 minus 2.34 and 10 power minus 4 into 12.03 square into 12.3. So, calculating the power rating of the belt is 6.132 kilowatt. Then we calculate the length of the belt. So, with the equation we can take from the page number 7.61. So, L equal to 2C plus pi by 2 capital D plus small d plus capital D minus small d whole square by 4C. So, substituting value of C, D and small d. So, we will get the length of the belt equal to 2455.15 millimeter. So, we substitute C equal to 589.375 capital D is 575 small d is 200 and uh, substituting and calculating step by step by calculation is also given so that you can verify the answer so 2455.15 millimeter now the take the standard nominal inside length nominal pitch length and arc length correction factor for the section c so phd data book from page number 7.58 to 7.60 so we calculated 2455.15 millimeter so next higher value nominal pitch length 2494 standard value 2494 millimeter and the for this length the nominal inside length is 2438 millimeter and length correction factor is 0.92 now the service factor so we have to calculate the design power so the service factor from page number 7.69 is 1.1 for 16 hours per day so the specification service factor the number of hours of service per day is not given in the problem so we take 16 hours per day and arc of contact factor from the page number 7.68 it is 0 0.9 for the 141.8 degree of contact angle of contact then the design power rated power rating of the service factor divided by arc of contact factor into correction factor divided by arc of contact factor so arc of contact factor is 15815815815815815815815815815815815815815815815815815815815815815815815815815815815815815815815815815815815815815815815815815815815815815815815815815815815815815815815815815815815815815815815815815815815815815815815815815815815815815815815815815815815815815815815815815815815815815815815815815815815
to the first groove center is f equal to 17 millimeter. So, for this specification, we can even draw the diagram if required. So, after designing, after calculating all the parameters, we have to write the these details so that the evaluator, the examiner will understand your knowledge so that you will get the full credit. Next problem, example 2 from the November 2011 question paper, design a suitable V-belt drive to connect a 7.5 kilowatt 1440 rpm induction motor to run a fan at approximately 480 rpm for a service of 16 hours per day. The space available for the center distance is 1 meter. So, given data, so given data power equal to 7.5 kilowatt, speed 1440 rpm, the uh, motor speed is 1440 rpm, speed of the fan equal to 480 rpm. Speed ratio we have to calculate I equal to speed of the smaller pulley divided by speed of the larger pulley N divided by capital N 1440 divided by 480 equal to 3. Now the select the cross section of the V belt for the uh, belt based on the power to be transmitted. So referring to the page number 7.58. Now the power is 7.5 kilowatt. So we can select section B. Under the details of the section B, minimum pulley pitch diameter small d equal to 125 millimeter, nominal top width W equal to 17 millimeter, nominal thickness T equal to 11 millimeter, weight per meter length equal to, uh, per meter length is 0.189 kilogram force. Then we calculate the diameter of the larger pulley, capital D equal to I into small d equal to 3 into 125 equal to 375 millimeter. So, we take the C by D ratio from the table, page number data uh, 7.61. For I equal to 3, C by D equal to 1. And remember, in this problem, the C value is given. The space available for the center distance is 1 meter. That does not mean that the center distance is 1 meter. Because initially, if we, if we take the center distance equal to 1 meter, on the final calculation, the center distance will be more than the 1, mi 1 meter, which is not permitted. So, we so understand, center distance exactly value, it, center distance is specified, you have to take. You now, what is given? The space available for the center distance. Now, we design as per the design procedure. If the center distance more than the 1 meter, then we reduce the center distance for 1 meter. Then accordingly, we adjust the other parameter. Now, we go by the design procedure, C by D ratio equal to 1. So, center distance equal to C equal to D equal to 375 millimeter. Then, arc of contact we calculate, theta equal to 180 minus capital D minus small d divided by C into 60 equal to calculating it is 140 degree 180 minus 0 0.375 minus 0 0.125 divided by 0 0.375 into 60 equal to 140 degree. Then belt speed S equal to pi dn by 60. So pi into 0.125 into 1440 divided by 60 equal to 9.42 meters per second. Then we calculate the small diameter factor for I equal to 3 from the data book page number 7.62. Fb equal to 1.14, then we calculate the equivalent pitch diameter, de equal to dp into fb equal to 125 into 1.14 equal to 142.5 millimeter. Then we take the power rating of the belt for the section B. So, k kilo, power in kilowatt equal to 0 0.79, s to the power minus 0 0.09, minus 50.8 divided by de, minus 1.32 in 10 to the power minus 4 s square into s. So, this is the equation for the cross section B. Now, you substitute the value of S, 9.42 meters per second. So, 0 0.79 into 9.42 to the power minus 0 0.09 minus 50.8 divided by the D equal to 142.5 millimeter minus 1.32 in 10 to the power minus 4 into 9.42 whole square multiplied by 9.42 that gives 2.613 kilowatt. So, the power rating of the belt is 2.613 kilowatt. The length of the belt we calculate from the equation 7.61, page number 7.61, L equal to 2C plus pi by 2 uh, into capital D plus small d plus D minus D whole square by 4C, substituting all the numerical values. So, we will get 1576.7 millimeter, 1576.5 millimeter. Now, we take the standard nominal inside length, nominal pitch length and the length correction factor for the section B from PhD data book page number 7.58 to 7.60.
So, we calculated here 1576.7, the next higher value for the section B. So, it is nominal pitch length equal to 1694 millimeter and the corresponding nominal inside length equal to 1651 millimeter, length correction factor is 0.94. Now, we, cal we take the service factor, so it is 1.2, it is given for 16 hours per day and the induction motor. So, the specification we have to specifically uh, observe. Uh, the actually the service factor for a fan for run, running at 16 hours per day and the induction motor, the drive is induction motor. So, for that it is 1.2 arc of contact factor from the page number 7.68, it is 0.895 for 140 degree. Then we calculate the design power. So, design power equal to rated power into service factor divided by arc of contact factor into correction factor for length. So, substituting 7.5 into 1.2 divided by 0.895 into 0.94 equal to 10.7 kilowatt. Then we calculate the number of belt. So, design power divided by power rating of the belt. So, 10.7 divided by 2.613 this equal to 4.09. We round it to 4. So, approximately 4. So, the center distance, actual center distance from e case, using the equation page number 7.61. So, we have to calculate the parameter A and B. A equal to L by 4 minus pi by A, capital D plus small d. So, substituting the new value, L value, 1694 divided by 4 minus pi by 8 into 375 plus 125 equal to 227.25. The parameter B, capital D minus small d whole square by 8, calculating it is 7812.5. So, C, center distance C equal to A plus square root of A square minus B. So, 227.25 plus square root of 227.25 square minus 7812.5, this is 436.6 millimeter. This is the actual distance which is less than 1 meter. It is less than 1 meter. If this value is more than 1 meter, then we have to adjust the value of capital D and small d, then we, we have to make it to the required center distance. Then design details of the belt. Belt selected is B1651. So, 1651 is the nominal inside length for the pitch length into IS 2494. Diameter of the larger pulley 375 millimeter. Diameter of the smaller pulley 125 millimeter. Center distance 436.6 millimeter. Nominal pitch length 1694 millimeter. Nominal inside length 1651 millimeter. Nominal top width W equal to 70 millimeter. Thickness is 11 millimeter. Number of belt equal to 4 and the specification of the pulley. So, this we have to take from the data book straight away. Specification of the for the pulley for cross section B. So, pitch width equal to LP equal to 14 millimeter, minimum distance down to the pitch line B equal to 4.2 millimeter, angle 34 degree 2 beta equal to 34 degree, center distance is center distance between the grooves is 19 millimeter, edge of the pulley to the first groove center is F equal to 12.5 millimeter. So, the in the same page from where we take the data, the diagram will be available. If it is required, you have to draw the diagram as per the specification. The next example, example 3, uh, design a V belt drive, calculate the actual belt tension, average stress for the following data. Power to be transmitted 7.5 kilowatt, speed on the speed of the driving wheel 1000 rpm, speed of the driven wheel 300 rpm, diameter of the driven pulley 500 millimeter, diameter of the driver pulley 150 millimeter, and the center distance is 925 millimeter. So here it is given center distance is 925 millimeter. So we have to use this value for all our calculation. And this question was repeatedly asked many times. Uh, May 2015, May 2006, November 2006 and May 2007. So, you write down the given data, power equal to 7.5 kilowatt, speed of the motor is 1000 rpm, speed of the uh, driven wheel is 300 rpm and the diameter is, larger diameter is 500 millimeter, smaller diameter is 150 millimeter, center distance is 925 millimeter. Now, speed ratio, speed ratio equal to speed speed of the smaller pulley divided by speed of the larger pulley, small n by capital equal to 3.3, 1000 divided by 300 equal to 3.33 and we have to select the cross section of the belt for the power to be transmitted. So, for the 7.5, once again we take the cross section B. 
and we write down the given data diameter of the smaller pulley now the given value you have to take all in our, in our calculation 150 mm nominal top width 700 mm nominal thickness is 11 mm weight per meter is 0.189 kg force diameter of the larger pulley it is given 500 mm center distance is also given c equal to 925 mm arc of contact we have to calculate from the data book so using the equation 180 minus capital d minus small d divided by c into 60 degrees is equal to 157.3 degree 180 minus 0.5 minus 0.15 divided by 0.925 into 60 equal to 157.3 degree then we have to calculate the belt speed so belt speed s equal to pi dn by 60 so pi into 0.5 into 1000 divided by 60 equal to 7.85 meters per second then we take the small diameter factor for i equal to 3.33 fb equal to 1.14 from the page number 7.62 then we calculate the equivalent pitch diameter de equal to dp into fb so 150 into 1.14 equal to 171 millimeter then we calculate the power rating of the belt for the section b cross section b we take this equation kilowatt power in kilowatt equal to 0.79 s to the power minus 0.09 minus 50.8 divided by de minus 1.32 in 10 power minus 4 s square into s so substituting the value of s 7.85 meters per second so 0.79 into 7.85 to the power mi minus 0 0.09 minus 50.8 divided by 1 171 minus 1.32 in 10 power minus 4 into 7.85 whole square into 7.85 so calculating the value it is 2.76 kilowatt so the power rating of the belt for the section b is 2.75 kilowatt then length of the belt we calculate using the equation page number 7.61 so l equal to 2c plus pi by pi by 2 capital d plus small d plus capital d minus small d whole square by 4c substituting the value of capital d small d and c value so you substitute 2 into 925 plus 5 by 2 into 500 plus 150 plus 500 minus 150 whole square divided by 4 into 925 calculating length equal to 2930.6 millimeter now we have to take the standard length for the section b standard nominal inside length nominal pitch length and the length correction factor from the data book for the section b so next to this value 2930.6 the nominal pitch length available is 3091 millimeter the nominal inside length equal to 3048 millimeter and length correction factor is 1.07 then we take the service factor from the page number 7.69 so 1.2 for 16 hours per day so again this we, this we assumed then arc of contact from the page number 7.68.94 arc of contact factor is 0.94 service factor is 1.2 and length correction factor is 1.07 then we calculate the design power so design power equal to rated power into service factor divided by arc of contact factor into correction factor for the length so substituting 7.5 into 1.2 divided by 0.94 into 1.07 equal to 8.95 kilowatt so this is the design power the next step we calculate the length of number of belt number of belt equal to design power divided by power rating of the belt so 8.95 divided by 2.76 equal to 3.24 so we make it as 4 so we require 4 numbers of belt then we calculate the actual center distance using the equation page number 7.61 so we calculate the parameter a b so a equal to l by 4 minus pi by 8 capital d plus small d now the the number the length of the belt taken from the data book 3091 divided by 4 minus pi by 8 into 500 plus 150 equal to 527.43 and the parameter b capital d minus small d whole square by 8 500 minus 150 whole square divided by 8 equal to 15312.5 now center distance c equal to a plus square root of a square minus b square a square minus b so substituting 527.43 plus square root of 527.43 whole square minus 15312.5 equal to 1040.1 millimeter but earlier the value given is 925 but the corrected value correct value is 1040.1 millimeter then the design details of the built v built 
belt selected is B3048 IS2494. Diameter of the larger pulley 500 mm, smaller pulley 150 mm, centre distance 1040.1 mm, nominal pitch length is 3091 mm, nominal inside length is 3048 mm, W equal to 70 mm, T equal to 11 mm, and number of belt equal to 4. Then the specification of the pulley for the section B. So, pitch width is LP equal to 14 mm, uh, minimum centre distance down to the pitch line 4.2 mm, angle 2 beta equal to 34 degree, centre to centre distance of the groove 19 mm, edge of the pulley for the first groove F equal to 12.5 mm. So, these are all the design details. Then we have to continue the problem. We have to calculate the actual belt tension. So, we have to calculate the stress and the, uh, the actual belt tension. So, actual belt tension T1 and T2. Power transmitted per belt. So, the total power transmitted divided by number of belt. Total power transmitted is 7, 7.5 kilowatt. So, 7500 divided by 4 equal to 1875 Newton. So, the power transmitter per belt is 1875 Newton. We have 4 number of belt. Then power transmitted is given by P equal to T1 minus T2 into V. So, substituting 1875 equal to T1 minus T2 into 7.85. So, we have a equation, we get a equation T1 minus T2 equal to 238.85 Newton. Now, we have to find out the value of T1 and T2. We have another equation T1 by T2 equal to u to the power of mu theta by sin beta for V belt. So, theta equal to the angle of contact, mu equal to coefficient of friction, which is not given in the problem and beta is the half angle. So, in the, in the calculation, we have one angle called a equal to 34 degree that is 2 beta equal to 34 degree from here we have to take the angle of the group so we have to take the angle here so 34 by 2 so mu we assume 0.3 coefficient of friction 0.3 and theta we calculate 157.3 we calculated we convert into radians pi by 180 so calculating t1 by t2 equal to 16.7 now we have two equations for t1 and t2 so t1 by t2 equal to 16.7 and t1 minus t2 equal to 238.85. Now, solving this equation, T1 minus T2 equal to 238.85. So, T1 equal to 16.7 times of T2. So, 16.7 T2 minus T2 equal to 238.85. Solving T2 equal to 15.21 and T1 equal to 254.06. Then, the centrifugal tension equal to M into V square. So, M equal to mass per meter length. So, 0 0.0, 0 0.189 into 7.85 square equal to 11.65 Newton. So, T1, T2 and centrifugal tension, everything is calculated. The max, so, T1, among the T1, T2, the maximum value is 254.06. Now, the cross section of the belt. So, this is the cross section, 2 beta. This is the angle, 2 beta. So, cross section of the belt equal to T, that is thickness into W, top bit, minus T into tan beta. So, point substituting 0 0.011, substituting value in meter 0 0.001 into 0 0.017 minus 0 0.011 into tan 17. So, it is 1.5 in 10 power minus 4 meter square. So, the average stress on the belt sigma equal to T max by A. So, A is the cross section of the belt. So, T1 plus T, so the maximum, maximum tension is T1 plus Tc divided by A. So, substituting sigma equal to 254.06 plus 11.65 divided by 1.5 into 10 power minus 4 equal to 1.77 10 power 6 newtons per meter square. So, this is the average stress on the belt. So, after calculating the design details, we have to calculate the average stress on the belt and tension on the maximum tension on the belt. We stop here. So, these are all the books I published in the mechanical linear subject. You can refer to it for your better uh, preparation for the examination. So, the, uh, the solution, video lectures of the subject are uploaded in the YouTube channel. So, you subscribe the channel, use the videos for your better learning. So, thank you for watching. So, please post your comments. Uh, if you, you can contact me through my mail ID or WhatsApp number for a clarification on the subject. We will meet again in another video with a few more problems on the V-built design.